For anyone out there that wants to create content on social media, probably the most important thing is audio. And that's not just in the blind and visually impaired community. I mean, for us, absolutely good audio is essential, but that's just true in general. And in order to get good audio, you need a good microphone. So today we are reviewing this new microphone to see if this might be a good option for you and your audio needs. Hey guys, it's Sam with Blind Life. Welcome back to the channel. Today we are looking at the Mono PD200X USB and XLR dynamic microphone. Before we get started, a huge thank you to Mono for sending this microphone out for review. First, let's take a look at the microphone, talk about the hardware, what you get, all of that. And then I'm going to do a comparison between two other microphones, one of which cost about three times as much as this one. So first things first, the build quality. Um, honestly, it's really, really good. No complaints there. This is a fantastically well-built microphone. This is the style of microphone that hangs down from the arm, points right at your mouth, and you talk directly into it. It does have an elastic mount here that offers vibration control. That way, if you accidentally hit your desk or tap on the bar here, it's not going to sound too horrible. On the top, you have a dial that adjusts your headphone volume. So if you have headphones plugged into this and you're monitoring your audio, the dial there will adjust the volume. You also have a button here on top that will mute the microphone. So if I press it, and you have no idea what I just said. <laughs> then on the bottom here, next to all the ports, you have a small button, and this actually controls the RGB lighting of this microphone. So this microphone does have some cool RGB lighting effects available as well. And just clicking that button cycles through all the different colors you have available. As I mentioned before, this is a USB and XLR microphone. So whether you're set up for XLR or in my case, I'm using USB, this microphone has you covered. As far as accessories, you have a couple options if you go through the website, one of which, the one that I got, came with a microphone arm. And finally, you can get this microphone in either black or white. Okay, next we're going to do some audio tests. Now, to begin with, all of the audio you've heard so far has been coming from this microphone, and it is completely unprocessed. And that goes for the other two microphones as well. Okay, and here is the second microphone, which is just the Rode Video Micro on top of my camera. This is a very common microphone, especially for content creators, because it's such an easy microphone to use. It plugs directly into your camera. You don't need to worry about power. You don't need to worry about turning it on. It's just plug and play. And it's relatively affordable coming in right around $50. Another benefit of using a shotgun microphone is it's portable. Anywhere I take my camera, recording somewhere out on location, the shotgun microphone comes in super handy. Now we have the next microphone. This is a Saramonic SRMV7000. This is also an XLR USB microphone. This is a fantastic microphone, but it is much more expensive, coming in well over $200. If you'd like to learn more about this microphone, I'll include a link to its review in the description down below. But what do you think? Which microphone do you think sounds best? All right, let's jump back over to the Mono PD200X. I also want to quickly mention the Monolink software that you can download for free from their website for this microphone. This software, which is very high contrast, I love that, lets you tweak the sound of the microphone, customizing it to exactly what you want. You can quickly adjust the colors of the LEDs, the volume of the microphone. You have some equalizer features like a high pass filter, and there's even a compressor. I'll leave a link to this software in the video description down below. All right, guys. So which microphone did you prefer? If the pricing helps you to decide, the Saramonic is over $200. The Rode Video Micro is around $50, and the Mono PD200X is right around $75. If you'd like more information or to purchase the microphone, I will leave a link to both the website and the Amazon link for this microphone. Both of those will be down in the video description. 
But that's it for me, guys. Thank you so much. Sam with The Blind Life. I will see you next time.